Yo, what's up everybody? It's Chris coming to you with another one of my crazy crossroads. I am back. Big Joey C is with me as usual. Urban Ghosts, Urban Explorations. Guys, we are at a location. Now, here's the deal. I'm not going to give too much information because um, I don't know if anybody's aware, um, but the Airbnb video I had to pull down because um, too many people contacted the owner. It's just, it's just too overwhelming. So there's a house that I have access to. I was able to bring Joe with me as well. There was a very, very, very horrific crime here. I will tell you this, we had to drive two hours to get to where we are. Um, I'm, but outside of that, I'm not giving any more information than that. This place is very haunted. It was stripped down. They've been trying to sell the house for many, many years now. They cannot. There have been uh, stories of when there were people that were showing the house that all kinds of crazy stuff has been happening. So we are here. And then um, we're gonna do this video. I'm gonna come back tomorrow night, do a 30 minute alone challenge. Joe's gonna come back, he's gonna do his 30 minute alone challenge, and that's it, we're done with it. But outside of that, we can't even show you the outside of the house or anything like that. No offense guys, we love you very much, and I know you guys are doing what you do, um, but too much has happened to where it's unfortunately affected us uh, in having or me having to pull certain videos down and I just can't disclose too much information for that reason But I will tell you this very very horrific. We're about to go in. We're about to do this and it's gonna be insane ah! Oh yeah Alright, so we're going in. <clears throat> this place, it's, it's just absolutely a very horrific place. There, there's nothing in here. They took everything out. So the game plan is, is <clears throat> excuse me, that they're, they're going to uh, remodel it and try and start from scratch. And, uh, and uh, Chris, do you think we could say what happened here, or would I give it away? Um, it was a, f it's a, okay, so it's a small home, okay? <clears throat> I'm going to tell you a little bit about what happened here. It's a very small home, and there was the owner of the home, I don't want to give too much away without saying because they I know think it's in we Florida. Could say this in fairness, um, he, where he, the father killed his family. And his father son. killed himself. It was a, a murder suicide. But what the hell was that, Joe? Yeah, I thought I could hear something. I okay, know. so you know, you would think of a murder suicide as something as you know uh, maybe. You shoot somebody and then you shoot yourself. I mean, that's kind of what I heard. Uh, murder suicides generally are. Um, not the case here. This guy um, brutally massacred his whole family. I don't want to say how many people. Um, it is a small home, but um, it was a, it was a three bedroom home. Um, there were a lot more than three people that were in the home at the time of this. Um, he. Uh, <clears throat> He used a knife, he massacred his family, um, and then he was a coward and took a bottle of pills and he went to sleep 
and that's how he killed himself. It's, it's horrific. And what's weird, Chris, is I, I thought I heard a little whispering. No, it could be there is a road. Again, guys, it's, <clears throat> it this, is after midnight. There is a road, however, that's kind of busy over there. It seems like the story of our lives is always a busy road nearby. Um, Joe said he thought he heard a whisper, but I thought I heard a knock. Now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn the camera around and let you take a look at how this place is. Now, we came in through the back. The friend of mine left the back door open. <clears throat> so this is the front door. So we're going to come in through the front. And right here to the left is sort of the um, common living area where Joe's standing was the... Um, was Actually, I think the master bedroom was here. There was a bedroom there. Bedroom here. And then this was the garage area. So what they did is they're trying to turn the garage into another room. Oh my God, it's just such a scary, scary, sad place to be. So this was the master bath or whatever. Then there was a bedroom here. <clears throat> Came off of here. Oh, wow. That was something <laughs> from the ceiling. Then there was another bedroom over here. Little kitchen area. Another bedroom over here. Um, and then washer dryer area. <clears throat> leading into the garage. So, this is it. Like I said, it's a very small home. Um, it's just horrible how small of a home this is and how tremendous and horrific of a disaster was created in here. You said you heard a whisper, I heard a knock. And then, did you hear that? Right, there's a road, there's a main road right off the back of this. It's about, I, well actually, it's almost midnight. I guess because I know what happened here, it makes it super creepy. Um, That's this. It's okay. just me. But we're going to try out now. A lot of people have asked me, so many people write me about the necrophonic gap. And I've been using it several times, this is my opinion on it. I think it's a loop of voices. I just have a feeling that we're going to we're gonna do the necrophonic gap as, as a collaboration. So I want to see what happens here. Definitely think um, being here alone is going to be absolutely terrifying. I'm sorry, Joe. I'm sorry. We're over talking to each other, but I think um, I think uh, being here by ourselves is definitely going to be a little more terrifying. But we're going to do the we're going <coughs> to. We're going to do the necrophonic act while we're here. Um, then we're going to do an alone challenge. Because it's, uh, it's almost two hours away from where we live. So it's not that far. So I don't mind coming out by myself. So I think um, I'm going to come out tomorrow. Joe might come out the next day. <clears throat> the game plan was is just to kind of get a feel of the place. See what it's like. Um, it's really gutted. He said it was gutted. I know I've said it tons of times that um, when you get into a place, you get a certain feeling. Um, it's probably because of knowing what happened. <laughs> You're instantly on edge. So it's very, uh, very frightening place. <clears throat> Joe, that looks like, you know what that looks like, Joe? That, yeah, that looks like the little um, thing that like a doctor's office might pull in with a, you know, a blood pressure machine and all that. That's weird, right? The hell's it doing? <laughs> I have no idea. I don't know. Why is this the only thing here? Yeah, this is really strange, but 
It is what it is. What does it say on the ground here? Something happiness? Hop, hop, yeah, happiness. Or Hopkins. I don't know. Oh. Ellie Hopkins. <clears throat> now, there is a sign on this door here, no trespassing allowed. Violators will be prosecuted because, as you can imagine, part of this being torn down was this was very, very satanic. Um, all the walls had a bunch of things that were going on with um, rituals that were going on in this house. What was that? I just heard somebody talking. Like, it sounded like it was in here. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is like Oh my goodness. Oh, I cannot wait. I cannot wait. So there were all kinds of uh, people that were coming into this home um, and doing whatever they do, you know, rituals or whatever. So it is completely gutted. And we're very fortunate to have access to this place. <clears throat> it's kind of weird, right, how, they, how he said he closed off the garage like this? Yeah. Well, unfortunately, it's the owners are doing it because obviously. <clears throat> yeah, they're they're trying to sell the place, and I, you know, it's really sad. So, the original. I'm sorry. If writing on the walls and stuff like that, I guess people came here to perform rituals. I don't want to talk over Joe. According to him, when you walk in the house, if I'm not correct, one of the the bedrooms here is where. Where, where the bedroom would have been, where somebody was, where, where most of the people were killed. Most right? of the children were on this, to the left of where we walked in. This is where we should do the <clears throat> So, he purchased the house from the bank for pennies on the dollar, just thinking, no problem, you know, it'd be an easy flip. He's an investor. And um, he figured that he's been sitting on it for many, many years. Um, so, I believe outside of here, it's kind of hard to get, get your um, bearing straight on how everything is. But there was a small bedroom over here. <clears throat> you all right? Some kind of tool or something maybe. So what we're going to do, this might not be a long video, guys, the collaboration, because it's a small place. But like I said, our, our goal and our game plan was is to come check the place out, do the Necrophonic app <coughs> as a collaboration, and then we're going to come back and do our alone challenges. Um, well, you know what would be interesting, and I think we can say this with, without <clears throat> jeopardizing the location, but the name of the killer, his first name was Joshua, right, or Josh? So we maybe see if the Necrophonic app picks up Josh. No, that's that fine. That would be interesting. <coughs> so, <coughs> all right, so. The guy, and also to speak on what Joe's talking about, the, this, this specific case, <coughs> yeah, was a guy that had a um, very extensive federal um, um, criminal background. So we don't want to get into the specifics of it strictly out of the respect to the owner of the home, much like yeah. the owner of the um, Airbnb that I, I filmed that <laughs> I gave a little too much information and unfortunately I had to pull that video down but um, <coughs> wow anyway we're going to do the Necrophonic app <coughs> I am so sorry I know that's disgusting <coughs> we're going to do the Necrophonic app Obviously, I'm not going to talk too much about the case, but I think it's fair to say, and, and we agreed that the name Joshua or Josh, the gentleman who killed the people in this house. I'm curious to see if the Necrophonic app picks this up. It'd be an interesting thing to see. Then uh, maybe we'll do a lights out or something. I'm just curious to see if we pick up anything. But I, I, I honestly think I heard a, a faint whisper and some knocking. 
but you know, who's to say? Every yeah. time you know there's playback, we hear more stuff. So. So what's, what's interesting about this place? Is Man, I'm so sorry. Here, um, usually it's not as spooky, but to be honest with you, my like I can feel like the hair on my arm standing up. Oh. The fuck was that, dude? Mm -hmm. What the fuck was that? Right by that back door. <laughs> now I hope the camera. Look at the look at the tape. Look at the tape. Look at the tape. Do you see that? Yeah. What the fuck was that? Do you see that shit? Oh, I hope I got that, Joe. I hope I got that. Chris, what was that? Something just. Okay, it was so this right here. This, this right here. I'll this tape. Oh, I hope I caught that. It's like foiled. Something came out of the ceiling up there. Now. Paranormal. Well, they he said he said that there was there was. Literally, there were doors slamming when the uh, cabinet doors were slamming when they were showing this as a full house. All right, let's let's Sorry. get let's do the next phonic app. <laughs> I I hope to goodness I caught that. I think I caught it. I hope I caught it. It made me freaking jump. It kind of went. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Something's wrong with us. We laugh at this. Oh yeah, we laugh, but I I'm scared yeah. to freaking death. All right, let's see what we get on the necrophonic app. Now, dude, that was freaky. <laughs> Again, it could be something falling out of the ceiling. <laughs> dude, it was this. I swear it was up here somewhere. It was on that. I think it was on this part of the. You see how that's hanging right there? Yeah. Now, how does that? What's the coincidence? How does that tear and fall down to here? How does that happen? How is that coincidental? <laughs> Explain that to me. You know, it's weird though. I heard a voice right before that coming. I know, I know. There, yeah. So I'm pretty sure that. You know what uh, it is? I don't know, but here, to all you people that like to debunk everything we do, it's great because I'd well, like to figure it out. But tell me how that happened, please. Please yeah. tell me how that mm. happened. That was fucking crazy. Dude, that was awesome. <laughs> Sound like something fluttered. <laughs> well, what's crazy is that voice that came from. <laughs> A voice came from over there. Something fell from here. I gotta. You know what? By the way, guys, um, I just wanna, I just wanna tell you guys this much. All right. As you may or may not have noticed on my uh, social media pages, I got another motorcycle. I'm so excited about it. One. Joe's getting one. We're going to ride. We're gonna ride like we stole something. So okay. anyway, today I. Uh, my father moved in with me. I'm taking care of him. It's breakfast, lunch, dinner, giving him insulin, all that good stuff. But uh, today I had a window. It was an opportunity. I was able to get out. I had quite a few beers. I got home waiting for Joe to come pick me up to take me out here. I had a couple more drinks. So <laughs> I'm sort of like two drink diet, uh, diet. rum and diet coach rum and Joe diet, right baby. now. So I got a good little something going. It wore off by the time we got here. But yeah, so if I look a little day. silly. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I've been having a great day, guys. All right, you want to try this? Though? Let's do it. Gonna, Let's do it. We're going to try the necrophonic app. <coughs> um, is this place haunted? Let's, Let's see find if this out. Picks up any intelligent responses. Um, now, again, it may, on? it may not. How can I pick this? But it usually does, which is. I wonder really, if I can really do cool. a little menage a day. Yeah. Let's get Camera. them both up there. Look at your wide-angle lens. I love it. Yeah. Joe's. Joe's like a tuna can. I have, I have a it's wide, wide, long lens. Yeah, he's like a tuna can. <clears throat> Mine's just long. Mine is long and wide. And lens. <laughs> he's like I, a, you know. <laughs> he's honestly like a uh, Sam's Club yeah. family tuna, you know, the big uh, family pack <laughs> tuna can. Look how wide that lens is, and then That's mine awesome. just... Yeah, I gotta get one of those. Well, if I don't have to keep pulling down these videos, I might be able to afford a wide-angle lens. Oh. Oh. What? Hang on. I think we can do this, right? Let's see. My... Why does yours go out like that? I don't know, I'm scared. Oh, oh okay. Oh, we're okay, we're okay. We're good. We're okay. Okay, hang on. <laughs> yeah, all right, there might be a cut in this video because I don't yeah. know what the heck's going on. Hey! Yay! All right, so <clears throat> if you guys compare videos, 
Joe's has all the way down to my hey, my pow, my chocha, my chochaini, and mine's like right here, right here. Oh, there you go. My video's here. Joe's is pow, pow. You get to see Booyah. package. Booyah. No wonder why you guys view his more. You can see his package. Exactly. And you know what? Mine, they're like, we just see your flat freaking bird chest. This looks like a freaking bird now. All right, let me back up a little. Hey, I don't have Zoom though. All right, All right. so. Anyway, sorry guys. We are going to see what's going on look at this tonight idea. on this. Oh, look at that. Did you know Chris used to break dance? Oh, hell yeah. They called him Kid Rock. Electric back in the day. Kingdom. Yeah, Electric Kingdom. I remember. Two. Boom. Boom. Ain't it a pity cause you hate the city? What? 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 I didn't hear anything. Chris heard something, I didn't hear anything, so. Alright. What'd you hear, man? Okay, I heard something then. So this is like when, like, cow. Whew, all right, this is uh, this is freaky. Okay. <clears throat> all right, so we're looking for the name Josh or Joshua, and we're looking to see if the Necrophonic app actually gives us any inclination what may have happened here. All right, let's do this. He was mad. Can you tell us if there's any spirits in this place? Girl hurt her, I heard. Help. What was the name of the person? <laughs> Responsible. Who, who responsible for the crime here? He's dead. That's what I heard. And then I heard he hurt the girl. Get out now. Get out now. What happened here? Can you tell us? What was the name of the person responsible for what happened here? So I keep hearing something that sounds like he was hurt or but Lucifer. Why did why did you kill your family? They're gone. They're gone. Did you... What is your name? So I haven't heard the name Joshua at all. I don't think. What? No, I just did. What I think the just said fuck? Josh. It said Josh! It said Josh! 
Oh my house. god! Get the fuck out of here! That's just cool. <sighs> Josh, can you tell us a little bit more? Why did you do what you did? It was crazy. <laughs> the devil made me do it. Okay. Why did you do what you did? Why did you do what you did? Josh, Josh. I think that's what he said. We were watching? Josh. Did you say we were watching Josh? All right. <clears throat> How many people were in this house? Let's see, we know the number. How many people? How many people were in this house? Six. Six. That's really messed up because we knew the number. Guys, we knew the number was six. Six. Oh my god, dude. So Are tell you us. Are fucking kidding me with this thing? It's so crazy. Are you fucking kidding me? All right, so again, guys, it's picking up what. Are you fucking kidding me? So crazy. Dude, I am. I'm... <clears throat> Ooh, this is so awesome. So tell us. <laughs> Are there any spirits that live in this place now? Stop what? What do you want us to stop? Stop asking questions? Asshole. Fuck you, you're an asshole. No, don't do that shit. I don't want to get scratched. <laughs> I don't even... Uh, uh, I think we'll be fine. You hear that, right? Alright, so... I don't know if you guys are going to pick up, but there's voices back there. I don't know if the camera's yeah, going to pick it up maybe we'll due shut to this. this off. All right, so what would you just hear? I'm From behind. behind. All right. Are you behind us making noises? <clears throat> I hate this thing. All right, guys, so All right, we're at 20. We want to stop 26 this now. minutes. Now, until I actually <clears throat> play this back, I don't really know definitively what we captured, but it sounded like Josh. Definitely Tell me this isn't six. the scariest so thing ever. Here, so. I'm to go back six people. There's no doubt in my mind it said six. The first time we thought we heard Josh, we was a little unsure. Second time, definitely. But it sounds like there's so much going on, right? <clears throat> All right, so I think we've accomplished sort of our goal here to come shoot a quick collaboration, and then we're going to come back. <clears throat> Would you like to do at least try lights out? Yeah, absolutely. I think that's a good idea. I am fucking really freaked out by that necrophonic app, Joe. Really yeah, freaked too out. <clears throat> don't talk about that shit. I don't want to get scratched again. All right, let's do. Uh, we're gonna do a little lights out. Oh, uh, you know, I am worried about that. You know, I am worried about getting scratched because it felt. If you've ever been bitten by a fire ant, it felt like I had the biggest fire ant I've ever had in my life on me but again it's a small space guys it's a small house i'd say it's about 1400 square feet it's like a big garage be careful man don't 
<clears throat> right, Joe? About maybe not even, maybe 13, 1400 square feet. Let's do lights out. Then we're gonna get out. <clears throat> it has a door here and a door here, like, and a door there. Almost in a row. <laughs> There's three entrances. Pick one. Well, hold on a second. Right. It has three front doors. Yeah. You know what? You know what, Joe? I bet you this garage was converted. was converted into rooms. Yeah, that makes sense. <clears throat> In the garage, this would have been, I suppose, well. well... The kitchen was right there, I know for sure, because it went off the back. You can see where the sink was. The bathroom was over here. And then there was a bedroom here, right? And then on this back side, there was the washer-dryer. Bedroom here, bedroom in that corner, bedroom there, and then the master uh, bathroom. Those are two bathrooms. Okay. All right. So Let's do lights out. All right, guys. So we're gonna try lights out and see if we capture anything, and hopefully we do. And then we're gonna come back over the next couple of days for thirty minutes of movie challenges, which would be great. Let's do lights out. That really freaked me out, John. Yeah. All right, so if there's any spirits in here, we're not afraid of you, so please, you know, feel free to tell us what you want to tell us. I think you're a coward, is what I think of you. You heard that? It sounded, did you just hear like, it sounded like a name? You heard that, right? Same I, corner. I, I heard like a whisper coming from over there. So we just go along. We're trying to walk over there. Be careful. All right, guys. Both our cameras shut off because we hit 30 minutes. It's like. Chris's camera does the same thing. 30 minutes, camera shut off. So we're going to do the lights, we're gonna do out, lights again. out again. And, uh, you know, I'm really curious to see what we pick up. I mean, it's hard to say. I mean, you think you hear voices we in hear here. Stuff. It could be road noise. We'll let Joe talk a really play this back, I'm not sure. But when we were over there, we were walking into <clears> the <throat> room. And I'm pretty sure that I heard, like, a whisper. Like that. It sounded like a name. Like, yeah. it sounded like falling a name. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to do lights out again. There's definitely, and, uh, definitely some whispers going on in tonight. here. Definitely some whispers going on. I thought I heard some, that, that friggin' tape dropping before. Oh my God, crazy. Lights out. Morning, man. Stay right here. Yeah, this is where we were hearing okay. stuff pretty much the whole time. Yeah. Oh, okay. There we go. So the thing is, we can have these lights off like this. Joe, what Joe, Joe, what the fuck is that? Turn your light. What was that? Oh. <gasps> Oh, look, at this. <laughs> look at this. That's fucking awesome. Are you fucking kidding me? It sounded like it moved. It sounded like it was rolling, but is that where it was? I don't know. We have to look at our footage, but <gasps> the cord was moving on this thing. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> All right. <clears throat> this is actually, honestly, I'm going to tell you this much, Joe. This place is, might creep me out more than... Any other place just being here by well, myself. What's weird about this is that there's no reason for that to move. Oh, wait a second. You know what? It didn't move. Look. What? Remember we filmed that name? This thing wasn't on the name. Oh, that's right. You're right, dude. You so are that right. thing was look, like look, 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 look at the trail. Look at the trail. Right? Is that a trail? Yeah, look, 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 look. Look. You can see it rolled through. That was what it was, Joe. See that? Really freaky. Huh. Fuck that. The cord was moving. Fuck that. I didn't see that. this thing move, but it sure sounded like it did. That is. Dude, look at. Oh. oh. 
Wait a second. Look at this too though. All this brushed up over there. It's like where it slid in. That. Holy shit, dude. What is this supposed? Oh, look. Ass. <laughs> it's saying you're a hop ass. Maybe it's trying to tell you hop your ass out of here. Right. <laughs> it might be. That's. I just I'm trying to figure out. Dude, that would that definitely that that's crazy. Let's turn yeah, the lights out for one second. There. Let's yeah, we were well where were and we? We were, we were about right here. here but we were filming that way. Joe and I were right around right about here. Right in this area. That's really uh and then we heard Oh man, dude, we need to like invest in a that again then. <clears throat> we need to invest in a infrared. Infrared like stationary what was that? like a crash or something. Oh my god. So this this what's really weird is okay, so it moved. But why is this like this? This is what I don't understand. This looks like something went Well, through. all right. Well, in all fairness, be prior to that coming through, we could have walked, walked through it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So I mean, obviously, there's nobody in here but us. That's so weird, man. Alright, you know what? <clears throat> Just for shits and giggles, and we'll get out of here. Let's see if... You know, again, this is... This looks like some kind of medical equipment, which is kind of interesting it's weird. in itself. But let's see if the necrophonic... What's going to happen there? I'm just curious. I don't know if it will or not. It may, it may not. Who? Person. Who moved this? Did it just, you said it moved again? Yeah, just moved again. Can you move it again? Move that again. Can you tell us what this thing is and, and, and how it moved, please? No. The man. Holy fuck, dude! Shit. Right, my camera just. Holy fuck! Joe's camera just flipped over. Holy fuck! Who moved my camera? Alright guys. So, the camera could possibly be, I mean, it is possible that the camera could have fell over because of the stand, but it was pretty secure, so I don't know why it fell over. Chris said that moved again. I'm not sure because I wasn't really looking at it, but I guess we'll find out. Anyway, uh, I can't wait to come back here and do a 30 minute alone <coughs> challenge. There's really not much to this place, but it isn't spooky. Yeah. You guys decide what. Chris Gioa! Sorry about that. <laughs> Check out our I'm allergic to demons. <laughs> Sorry about that. That's it. We're getting out of here. That tape for sure, or whatever that was, I definitely caught. Um, I don't know about the moving of that uh, medical thing. There's a couple voices in here. Uh, Necrophonic app, you guys let me know what you think you heard down in the comments. I appreciate it. Like I said in the last video, um, I don't like to put too much um, in the script because I don't want to be suggestive. So um, if you guys are still cool with that, let me know. Um, but I will have that down below. Um, I will check all the comments. I know I don't get back to them all, but I do see them all. Um, I love you guys. Um, I'm going to probably come back out here tomorrow night. I got some time. So um, 
until next time, check out all the good stuff down below. Merchandise, cameos, all that good stuff. I love you guys. I will see you next time. I'm out of here. Deuces. <laughs>